Welcome back, friends and enemies. We have a new series starting here today. One I've been hyped about. I've been a fan of the series for years. This is what I've wanted. I've dreamed of. And I'm really fucking hoping this game achieves it. We're playing Pokemon Legends Arceus. And, and don't give me that Arceus bullshit. No, no, I, I don't care. You see that right there? That is a C. I do not see a fucking K anywhere near here. So it is RC. Yes. <laughs> do not fight me. <laughs> All right. All right. Well, Viv, we're going to go ahead and throw you at the front of it. Uh, why me? Uh, because God is talking to you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Speak to God. I got. It is well thou the, art here. That thou art here. I am that which humans call Arceus. Uh, you know what? You seem really passionate about this. I'm going to let you do your thing. Now I wish to know thine appearance. <laughs> I mean, you're asking. What do we look for, like? Uh, you're asking for, for a lot, buddy. Uh, what do we want to look like? Do we want to be a boy or a girl? Uh, I, I don't know. I hadn't really thought about it. Uh, uh I always go male because, you know, yeah. obvious reasons. Yeah. So, uh, uh I, might, I might go with this one. You, you wanna, let's be a girl? Yeah. Alright. Alright, yeah, let's, we can be Dawn. What is thy name? What, what is be? thy name? What do we wanna be named? Yeah. We can't merge our names. That comes out terrible. Yeah, it does not go well, but I have it. Josephine? Yeah. Okay. I can do Josephine. That works. Yeah, that's as it should be. We don't capitalize RJ. Hey, hey, you're you're saying it wrong. I just said no capital J. Yeah. Yeah, please. Josephine. No, me! Me! <laughs> Seek out <laughs> all Pokemon, and thou shalt find me once more. Alright, uh, we're I getting this second. Talk to, to Gon. I just chugged a and now you better hand me that monster energy drink. But first, we gotta get this phone. Oh no, not my phone. Your cell phone. Hi, God. Oh, is God gonna give me his number? Hey. Hey, God's giving you the digits. Can you order me a pizza? Oh, oh shit. Oh my God. And now we've been a, a second. Uh, of course, since this has been something Austin's been very excited about, I'm letting him do the actual gameplay. Uh, for now. I mean, yeah, there will be parts where I join in, but for now, it's, I buy Austin a lot of Pokemon games. That's all you need to know. Look, Look at, at those babies. What the fuck is his hat? I don't know. I don't He's got know a big poof ball. <laughs> Quick, bully him about the poof ball. You gave me quite the shock falling from the sky like that. <laughs> well, thank goodness. You see my more. <laughs> All right. Uh, uh, who are you? It, or you know what? I, I really don't care where I am. I'll be fine. Yeah, who are you? Uh, I'm excuse like me, freak. Insane. I mean, you fell out of the sky, you understand? Come on now. 
Who in the world does that? <laughs> I mean, I look like a... How is that unusual? I must say, your clothing is unusual. Who would I happen to have an acquaintance in? Uh, uh, these parts, would you? Uh, I, I doubt it. Doubt it, yeah. I see. You seem to be in a bit of a pickle. Man, it's almost like there's a whole genre of series all about this What's exact that situation. Uh, don't worry, that's just God. Just a storm. Uh, no. No. Oh yeah, yeah, I'll be fine. We're good. I've been in worse. This isn't my first time. I see. Well, no gentleman would abandon such a person as me for a person. Oh my, I've completely forgotten. I had just caught up to these three runaway Pokemon. You tumbled out of the sky. It's almost as if they knew you'd appear here. <laughs> oh, oh man. Like, do you even know what a Pokemon is? Of course I do. I've been playing this game for longer than you've been alive. Fine, that's a relief. <laughs> Though, you fell from the sky. It seems we have some common ground, eh? Well, <laughs> yes, well, uh, these three Pokemon belong to me, mysterious creatures that they are. Oh, yes, and what kind of your name be? Oh, what? so you're called Josephine. That name has quite the ring to it. I imagine it must have some lovely name. It means suck my dick. <laughs> oh, but I do apologize. I haven't even introduced myself. Don't worry, I see your name in the corner. My name is Laventon. I am something of a Pokemon professor. This is to say, I'm a scholar seeking to deepen our understanding of Pokemon. Yes, Pokemon such as these three Get back here! <laughs> oh, blast and bother! Don't be sorry, but I have to go catch my Pokemon! Alright, this this guy seems hopeless. Yeah. Alright, time to run away. Uh, apparently the answer is not swim. Oh, hey, I, I gotta crouch. Da na 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 Batman. I think so too. Oh man, is God giving me a sign here? What's this? Oh man. Oh, it's the new iPhone. New iPhone. Yeah, let me just stand right on top of it. It's the new iPhone. It does look like a phone. A message appeared on the screen. I bestow upon thee this arc phone and thy mission. Seek out all Pokemon. When Arceus hits you up with that late night text. Like, hey, I just need you to go and catch every Pokemon. Okay, well, how many are there? I don't know, a couple thousand, million, something like that. I stopped counting after yeah. fucking Gen 8. Or 6, Sign. wherever we're at. Yet another miss. <laughs> hey, you need some help? Aha, I'm glad you come to my rescue, my new friend from the sky. I tried catching my little runaways by tossing some Pokeballs their way. But I'm not the best at this sort of thing, you see. Oh, you suck. Does my narrative help? It does, it does. I'd love to give you a go at it, but perhaps I should tell you a bit about these three first. Now, that one is Rowlet. Is it Rowlet. Okay, Rowlet. Rowlet can photosynthesize like a plant, and apparently it battles using its sharp feathers. <laughs> Cyndaquil. Cyndaquil. The fire burning on the Cyndaquil's back will flare up whenever it's surprised or irate. irate. <laughs> oh, so what? The Pokemon 
one that near the pond is Oshawott. Oshawott naps while floating on the water, and it can battle using the shell-like object on its belt. Oh my, I knew you have to cover the most crucial thing. Hey, here you are, my girl, Pokeballs! Throw these at Pokemon to catch them. Alright, throw the balls, you catch the Pokemon. So many Pokeballs, just for fun. Alright. Well, each and every Pokemon is something. Let me fucking read. Let me fucking read. And that's where Pokeballs come in. <laughs> we throw the Pokemon. Uh, we throw the Pokeball at the Pokemon. The Pokemon go in the Pokeball. They Sometimes we get them. The ah, we're gonna ignore that. <laughs> that's an oversimplification of it at best. So, the way Pokeballs have always been described in every other, like, instance is basically that you throw this device, the Pokeball, at a Pokemon, and if it likes you enough, it can choose to be caught, in which case it will be digitized, and that's why you can store it in, uh, in po in, like, personal computers and shit. Alright, so... Did I used to drink these? No, it feels really small to me, too. I think they changed up the monster cans. No, they didn't change up the monster cans. This is like a... full sized can. I don't think so. I think they used to be... Oh, wonderful! You've caught a Pokemon! It seems you're quite the knack... You have quite the knack for this Pokemon catching business, Josephine. Josephine! <laughs> catching business, Josephine. Holy goodness! <laughs> Only two of my darling runaways left now. Still, this is the most unusual. You don't seem fearful from the Pokemon in the slightest. No, I got these. Let's go catch an owl. What? Oh, okay. I have to hold it. Shut up. the Cyndaquil's over there. No, it's Where is it? It's right there. It's right there. You failed. What? Hmm. Listen here, you little shit. Get in the ball. Caught it. Good job. I want to be the very best, like no one ever was. You see, three Pokemon you caught only just arrived at the village to help with our research. They won't listen to anyone yet. I know I'm reading that here. And as I mentioned, they bolted from the village almost as if they knew you'd come calling. But I must say, Josephine, I was taken aback at how well you use Pokeballs. <laughs> how is it that you catch Pokemon so ably when you've only just arrived here? Uh, well, I'm not a dumbass. You once can't help but think there's a reason you appeared here and now. I was chosen by God. Yeah, by he gave me this phone. That's exactly what it's doing. If you'll indulge me for a moment, there's something I'd like to share with you. Uh, we're not getting in You're your not van. We're not getting in your you van. See, I have a dream to compile this region's first complete record of its Pokemon. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's cool. We in the field call such a catalog a Pokedex. Yes, a proper Pokedex is a wonderful look at research containing detailed records of all the Pokemon to be found in the region. 
But in order to properly document Pokemon, one must of course catch them. There is no eyes of the rub, I am afraid. Pokeballs have only just been invented and not many have mastered the skill of them. And for you, a person with clear talent. This is a lot of story stuff. Yeah. Your goal is to seek out every Pokemon and mine is to have all those Pokemon caught. Okay. Alright. So, I know just a little bit about this tutorial, and that's basically all this is. So, this guy's basically saying, we're going to go to this village, and we're going to give these Pokemon back, and I'm going to talk to someone, see if they might be willing to provide you with a place to stay. I took like one drink out of it. Oh, okay, that is still not even half though. That's not half. I told you, I think they're, those cans are smaller. Because I'm pretty sure they used to be 16 ounce cans and now they're 12. Yeah, I know they have different sizes. Uh, this is just a normal monster can. I said that earlier and you said no it's not. Yeah, I, I I'm telling you, I think they made the normal cans smaller. That's what I've been saying. They shrunk the size of the normal monster so they can sell this and the big ones. Okay. Well, I don't want to debate Yeah, yeah, he's showing us off the village. People will talk about that big ass storm in the sky. Like it does exist. So, some uh, Pokemon lore I'm going to throw at you here. Uh, one of the gens, I believe it was Gen 5, took place in what was called the Sinnoh region. And in there, there is a city called Jubilife City. The main villainous team from that game was Team Galactic. So, now we're in Jubilife Village, and the head people here are the Galactic Team Federation or something like that. So, throwing a lot of like old shout outs that fans can catch on to. Alright, and our arc phone is also our GPS. Hey, can I stay here? I'm suspicious, huh? Oh, so I'm an outsider, so I can't get a place to stay, huh? What a fucking prick. No. A little bit, yeah. Well, don't worry, I caught those three, though. 
Yeah, you want me to read it off? Is that what you're alluding to? Yeah. If I hadn't been resting up after some Pokemon drubbed me with a move called Thundershock, I'd have corralled him for sure. But the professor, well... <laughs> Unfortunately, it's just as Ray says. I'm a clumsy sort of fellow, to put it mildly. <laughs> yeah. Talk shit, get over her, bitch. And I'm gonna help with the Pokédex. No idea what that is. Why? Why can't you take it? Hmm? I am the captain of the Galaxy Team Survey Corps. You may call me Silene. So, in the Sinnoh region, the main dude for Team Galactic was Cyrus. <laughs> Professor Leventon has told me how you helped secure his Pokemon when they slipped his control. And now it seems he would like us to feed and house you in exchange for your ongoing labor. You look to be 15 or so. Old enough to work. Can't simply take a stranger who wanders in. No, no, no. We gotta make you work. I don't wanna eat with this person. I don't need to eat with my boss. I fell out of the sky. This person saying, hey, throw these balls at some animals and you get free housing and food. Sure, I'll do it. Eh, I don't really want to eat with you either. You're still a weird old man. Ah, oh, well, you know that great hole in the sky? The one people call the space-time rift? <laughs> Our new friend fell right out of it! Wow! I wonder! Is that a joke? No. No, it's not. I fell out of that hole and somehow wound up on a beach. And that is sweet, region. Sure, they're all over the place. In the grass, in the forest, in the ocean, in my bathroom. In my bathroom? It's up to us and the survey corps to study them and figure out what kind of creatures they are. Magical ones. Crazy ones. Pokemon are terrifying creatures! All they know. But it's all but impossible to know what kinds of powers they might possess. Or what sorts of wondrous things they can do. What are we gonna do? There's just, there's too many of them. I swear to God, if you don't tell me, I will hurt Nobody you. in Team Galaxy can uh, catch three Pokemon. What? Nobody? We count ourselves lucky when we can catch a single Pokemon. Shut up, Benny. I'm sure we'll start to rain in the good captain's stress seating. I don't know. <laughs> if you make it into Galaxy Team, you'll never have to worry about a meal again. The team provides for all its members' needs, even if you fell out of the sky. See, that's the thing. I didn't fall out of the sky. I fell out of the space-time rift. There's a big difference. Really? Yeah.
Okay, so we've got to pass a trial tomorrow. All right, I can sleep tonight. If we fail, we will be expelled from the village to meet our fate or perhaps our death in the wild. I'm down. I think I'll live. I'll make it. Go throw me out there with a bunch of Pokemon. Give me like two Pokeballs. I promise I'll be fine. Time to turn in for the night. Okay. Go away, creepy guy. You too, simp. Oh, hey, this is kind of nice. Okay, so that's my my drinking water. What's that? Huh. Okay. Well, let's rest. Oh yeah, this is really natural. Yeah, that, that's natural. That's everything I needed. I don't know, probably the end of the world. 